Hi everybody, welcome back to Borderlands 2. My name is Mikey Dubs and today's video we got a special one. Roguelands Mini as of yesterday and Roguelands proper have a brand new update 1.1.0. It's time to go see what the changes are. Maybe I have to get a win on every character before I, I, I think I progress into any more randomness. So let's see what we can do playing Roguelands Mini. Already seeing, and I saw this on the Joel Stude video when he was, I think his video was entitled this borderlands has always had this problem but i didn't notice he was playing roguelands me in the background in the starting round underneath my mini map on the right hand side where it says starting round zero out of nine it used to be zero out of eight for roguelands mini so automatically we have more rounds at least one more round per tier it looks like so we'll see what that is i don't give any spoilers but also look another chest in the starting room sick let's hop up on this platform here oh wow what a fail jump I'm a, I'm a professional come on now jump made it that's it's just that easy it's just that easy all right let's do this right for my lifetime plus 26 percent we take those a nice fire sniper i've been playing a lot of borderlands 3 actually i downloaded the dialogue skip function and let me tell you big game changer huge game changer okay so my first option i'm gonna go with this this doll SMG. Launcher in a slot four. That'll be good enough. A thick rifle. I mean, I, I do have an assault rifle damage. Glass mod. Magazine size and gun damage. Plus five onslaught. I think we still go for the gun damage. And let's roll. Let's roll. We go to the fridge first. Very sick. I've had a brief hiatus on the channel. That is due to a lot of things, but the number oh my gosh. It's due to a lot of things, but number one is that my computer broke. So I'm on a new computer now, and my graphics con uh, quality is much, much higher. Is he cool down right? Yeah, we'll take that one. Chuck a turret down. Good, you're gone. Give me that iridium, too. I want to take my iridium. That's mine. Good night, bro. Yeah, I need to get a better weapon. What, how about this uh, assault rifle? This thick rifle? Good. Not bad, not bad at all. Okay. So anyways, I start blasting. Oh my gosh, all the misses. This guy's this guy, his hitbox is incredibly tiny. Does not want to take any damage, Pug. Ooh, and I got a um, Mopey's candy? Pyrex candy. Let's go. Oh, you don't want that work now. Turning a thick rifle into a into a an ogre oh i am going to, slowly dying though yeah. good stuff very very nice yeah i've been playing a lot of borderlands 3 actually yeah i got the dialogue skip and that gun with the dialogue skip is pog crazy no i feel like it really is someone's gonna be mad at me for not taking that scatter gun but it is what it is look at all these bullet decals Ease. All right. We're gonna we're gonna dance with the girl that brought us for sure. Rocking this assault rifle. Axon does like explosive assault rifles. Give me that quick juke. Don't speak to me, field rat. Oh, and dude, Pyrex is he's hooking me up right now. Absolutely hooking me up. Good night. Cool. What do we got in this chest? Ooh, and this little... I'm going to take a nice little slag option. Take a TDR. Is this better than my sniper? I, I honestly think it might be. I'm quick boy when I have that candy. That's nice. I'm not sure if that was a thing before. I don't think it was a thing before. Wait. I think I, I have super speed. Ladies and gentlemen, after the round is over, you get super speed now. Now that is a quality change, ladies and gentlemen. That is something I didn't ask for. Wow, what a change that is. You can't, you really can't ask. You can't ask for a better change. All right, let's see. No changes to this. I'll take that horror show. That scarab looks a little bit weak, honestly. Take it though. 
Very nice. I'm really liking this super speed change after round is over. Uh, that's just an absolute amazing quality of life change. I like team fire rate, steady plus metal storm. Ooh, but here's your grenadier, ladies and gentlemen. Plus six grenadier, plus five steady. Okay, there's no impact on that, but that's fine. These are some really nice skills, I'll tell you what. Okay. Let's go ahead and take five points into Metal Storm. And roll out! Really enjoying that super speed change. Like, that is just an absolute incredible change. That's just, that's the kind of change that I feel like it takes just a really, just a really smart person to, like, come up with that. Because I don't think you would ever, like I personally, I don't think I don't think I could have ever like thought about adding super speed after round end. But it's such a nice change because I can. It's a a big part of like it wasn't necessarily a problem that I had with Rogalands, but it was something that I was noticing, is that. Like for at least for recording, it was a lot of downtime and a lot of yap time after round. Of, ah, ah, ah! You gotta be kidding me with that! That barrel blew up and Jude's got that exp loader right next to me. Sergeant loader, can you go down? I'm slagged, bro. I can't do this. Well, I got. I have a crow super grenade, though. Yeah, eat this. Get, get wrecked. I thought. All right, let's go ahead and grab this vault symbol. You're talking to the guy who knows where they all are, even more than Joel's dude does, and he's the one who put them there. I think it was it. Could have been Pyrex. Let's see. Second wind health. I'll take it, but I think cooldown's better, and that's the one I'm rocking. That's the one I'm sticking with. Dance with the girl that brought us here. Let's have EXP loader. Go ahead and explode for me. Later. Now we get a little bit of metal storm. Ah, uh, this is bad news, bears. I'm gonna get some cover. Nice work. Super speed me. Super speed me. Really like it. I I I, I cannot express to you. How much I enjoy this change. All right, let's see what we got. We got a Hulk. I think the Hulk does have a place in the squad in the number three slot. Okay. Vladov Garnet rifle, an Aquamarine Snyder. You know what? Let's let's go ahead and throw the Snyder on my slot one. Oh, Snyder! Thank you. And that could, that could be a replacement for my, my current, my current AR. A little spitter action. With Metal Storm, the spitters do, they do things. They hurt people. All right, five more points. Boom, steady is active. Longbow turret, don't necessarily need it, but I like where we're at. Hopefully, I'm going to try to get a win with each and every character, I think, on the new on the new update. That way, I can continue to call myself the GOAT. Fire rate 5.2, fire rate 4.2. Its fire rate isn't that much slower. Its damage is it's higher. It's um, 428,000 per shot, but how much is it actually? We're, we're, we're almost, we're more than doubling that. I can get a little melee action. There we go. Very sick. Dude. I think with the... I mean, I had speed run times for Rogue Lands Mini, but all, that is... Everything is different now. This is a total game changer. Oh, explosive damage me? Explosive damage me? Ah, uh, incendiary, sniper. Okay. Oh, oh, oh. Dude. Don't scare me like that, bro. I'm really liking that Metal Storm, though. I'll tell you what. In my Borderlands 3, I've been playing Flak. That's been the guy I've been rocking. I've done so much Moe's. I'm, I'm decided I'm finally going to try to get a Flak up to max level. And I've been I've been brainstorming, because in my time off, I was like, okay, what am I... How can I turn Borderlands 3 into content? And you guys let me know, like... I really don't... That's the hardest part is the, in, in YouTube in general is the ideation phase is coming, coming up with the idea to make a video. And it's easy when you have... Ooh, it's easy when you get quads. 
it's easy when you have like a really fun game drop but what happens when you know and that's don't say the content dries up but you know what happens when the content dries up See that snyder absolutely two shot those kids just saying okay i think what we're gonna want to do is i like to get i like willing as far as skills go so let's just start going down this left side tree i mean that's super speed okay Not gonna take any of that trash. Um, ba -ba -dum, ba -ba -dum. The Grenadier class mod is probably the best. Non legendary. All right. Vault symbol me. Corrosive. Ooh, how could you betray me like that? But now I can farm out the stages so much faster. Like, so much faster. Which is insane. I might go back to Rogue Lands proper, if, depending on how long these videos go, right? Okay, what you got for me? Bandit, a bandit slag launcher. Ladies and gentlemen, we are going to the moon. Axton, when it comes to the dragon fight, and I'm assuming there still is a dragon fight. Uh-oh. Let's get that Goliath a little bit upset. Oh, nice. Put me on a Snyder. I need to actually, I'm going to switch over. Th throw a toss a turret down. I have explosive resistance, so I can point blank this thing. The Grenadier class mod gives you explosive resistance as well as explosive damage, so. Or grenade damage, I should say. I lost my I lost my kill skill. Okay, we're gonna blast this guy. Raging Goliath. Getting okay damage on him. Not bad. Okay. Let's take this adaptive shield. Although the turtle's probably better. Yeah, I like that slower recharge or the faster recharge lane, all that. All that jazz. What you got with all that jazz? All that jazz inside your jazz. You know what I'm saying? Alright, cleanse this dude. Oh, I'm getting rinsed. Yeah, rinsed and rinsed 100%. Okay, we are going to go for our launcher and just shoot at somebody. Oh, that's nice stuff right there. I'm a master grenadier. Switch back to my... My assault rifle needs to get reloaded. Excuse me, I'm trying to... I'm trying to get clear. Thank you. Oh, that's no bueno. Of all things that are bueno, that's certainly not one of them. Okay. For some reason, my launcher has, like, infinite magazine size. Later, kid. Get critted. Get critted again. I'm just the goat. Okay. What's this launcher's magazine size? 10. Holy cow, it's more than my max ammo. This Hulk should do good deeps. Yeah, yeah. I say. Like that. Like that a lot. I want to have Metal Storm up for this for this guy. I don't I'm not gonna have it. Let's slag him and run. Ah, and I'm down. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the end. This is the end. My only friend, the end. Four, three. Got to be really accurate here. Oh, you thought it was the end. And that's the best part. I'm never over. Absolutely never over. Ooh, but nice little upgrade. Take that. If I take that, Willing is an, I think it's a must have here. Very nice. Crack a bottle, let your body waddle. Right, final bottle. Big bottle. Give me something good to eat here. An amp shield sounds nice, but I'm not gonna run it. That adaptive shield is it's just weaker all across the board. I take a singularity, but I'm really? Bunch of trash? Okay, well that's fine. Now that I have my my willing skill, I'll feel a lot better. Maybe I should go. Take that T door. Maybe we should. I should go. Adaptive shield. I'll make the switch now. Honestly, 
I'll make the switch. Keep everybody happy. And last red chest when we head out. I love that super speed. Love it. Okay, let's roll. Three, two. Which boss do we get? All right, we got uh, Mr. Dwarf. I'm excited to see. I, I, I think I have an idea of what round six is going to be. And I'm not saying that it's I'm the reason I was entered into the game, but I, when Josu put out his community tab, uh, his community post about what we wanted to see added, I was, I was advocating, I was advocating for this type of round to be added to the game. So I'll show you guys. I think other people might have been as well. I don't think I was the only one, but that's nice, easy slags. We destroy Gold Golem from afar. Oh, hello, people. My fiance Cindy and, and her dog Ajax just got in here. Oh, there's a loot dwarf. Hopefully, this guy actually gave me a faster clear speed. Hey, Cindy, big news. Rogue Lands 1.1 came out yesterday. Big update. And they I think they put in one of my changes. So I'm blocking out my gourd. Okay, loot enemy. What you've dropped for me. Legendary Ranger class mod. You know, I might have to make the switch to that Ranger. Uh, I, I, I kind of want to wait until after this round is over. But it would give me a lot of flexibility. What I want to do is activate one of my, activate my kill skill and then go for boss while he's still slagged. That's like, no, that's like the go-to set up here. Let's get a quick reload off. And I have Metal Storm active. I don't, he's not slagged anymore, but I don't want to waste my precious kill skill time. Uh, let's do this. Kill you. Drop you. Switch. Still have Metal Storm active. There we go. There's some nice deeps. Gold Golem will be going down here. Okay, good. Make sure we land these shots. Now we got Metal Storm. Golden Golem doesn't like that. Oh, I'm telling you right now, he does not like that at all. Let's go for one more kill. Make sure all the bullets land. It's a metal storm action, and Gold Golem should be going down here. Good night, bro. And that. Oh, Layud Miller. Can you ask for a better gun? I'm anointed. I'm 100% anointed. 662,000 base damage, pretty much 663. With a 5.2 fire rate, insanely fast. And look at that bonus crit damage, ladies and gentlemen. Now we're sauced. Now we are absolutely sauced up. Hey, don't go in the lava. Can I go in the lava? Do I die? Okay, I don't die and I have invincibility. Sick. 1.0.9 update. Pimpernel! Oh my goodness. You are getting so lucky. Okay. It's going to take a lot to, to replace anything that I'm rocking right now. So we are absolutely juiced to the gills. So in the number one slot, this is my slag regular sniper is getting replaced by a slag pimp for now. There's just absolutely no no argument to be rocking something else. Where'd you go? There she be. Slag pimp for now. All right, in slot three, I'm actually going to put a heartbreaker for healing purposes. And let's go Legendary Ranger class mod. Oh my gosh, the amount of the amount of free points we get. I don't think we need steady anymore. We could go. We could drop our points in this skill tree and, and put them into double up or something. But steady is still a decent skill. Let's go Onslaught. I, the thing is, if I get to Gemini, I can activate my kill skills whenever I want, including against the dragons. Let's do this. Murderlin's Temple. Yep, Horde Round. This is a Horde Round, ladies and gentlemen. That is sick. Oh my gosh, okay, maybe it's not sick. Ah! There's a million of them. Help me. Remember now, do your thing. Yes. My AoE. This is what I'm talking about. Oh my gosh, there's so many of them. Look at the mini map. There's a million of them. 
They're all, they all died. They all died the same way, though. Pimper now me. Oh my goodness. I'm running low on ammo. I haven't gotten to an SDU yet. I'm gonna have to swap up. Y'all did not want that work. I'm telling you. Find the token of wealth. Okay. I think I saw my boy Jolts do it. Was that not, was that not the token of wealth? I swear. Maybe I was supposed to do it beforehand. Ooh, shotgun. We got relics. That's nice. I'll take the shotgun damage relic. And actually, now that I'm thinking about it, ladies and gentlemen, I have a sniper rifle damage relic. We actually go to the moon here. Um, right, Let's go onslaught. At this point, I think we stop here. And I want to go down the this tree. Let's do preparation. Really, I really enjoyed that horde round. That is a nice addition. So far, the two main additions that I've seen is super speed on round end, which helps you clear the chest faster. Amazing change. Amazing. And the second change I've seen is... The second change that I've seen is that horde round, which is incredible as well. All right, so we already know that sniper is going to come in handy. So let's, let's cap out snippety snipe. And let's see if we can get a secondary weapon type here. I think a fire leech does a lot of what we need to do. It's actually, let's go ahead and get Grenage capped. We have a little bit of extra for my boy Launchy Launch. And I don't know what raid boss we're fighting, but I don't think it stands a chance. Okay, this is the one that stood a chance. <laughs> okay. Just in case me. That's a just in case me. Now I'm going to Lyud Milla. And we're gonna try to rinse this dude in the head. If I had like a Sincero or something, I could uh I could take off his head. Oh, I was gonna say I'm an absolute professional if I got behind that in time, but unfortunately I did not. Okay. Let's get a reslag. It's a nice little reslag. Now the Light Milla. This should be the absolute fastest Pyro Peak Shredder in the entire game. Yeah, that's a that's fast Pyro Peak kills right there. Ooh. Yeah. Little bark bark from the boy HX. Holy. Okay. Let's see what we can do here. Oh, he's gonna he's gonna dot me. That's unfortunate. Um, yeah, I don't really want to be dotted. I'm gonna summon in more spider ants here. As long as I don't get punched, I'm fine. Don't punch me, don't punch me, I'm sterile. Don't punch me, I'm sterile. Ow, he punched me. But I cleanse my debuff, that's all that matters. Where is this guy at? I need to get a slag off on him. Okay. Let's, let's kill one of these lads. Now I got my, all my buffs. Good stuff right there. We got a big chunk of his health down. Yeah, we lost a little bit of our ammo, but worth. Okay, we need to cleanse. And what I also need to want to do is get some blammo. Don't close the gap on me, Pete. The worst place for Pete to be is exactly where he's at right now. On top of that. Okay, on top of the waterfall, because then you can't cleanse your debuff. I shoot him once. Swap to Lyud Milla. I'm trying to I'm trying to conserve my ammunition here. Let's get one kill. Light millimeter. This this might be it. Come on. Swap. That was a, a bad swap. That was my bad. Okay. Need to get one tag off on that guy. Okay, I am dotted up. Blast this guy. Bla blast this guy. Good. Alright, Pete. Your days are numbered. There we go. Very nice. Very clean kill. Pirate Pete's the toughest raid boss to kill. And you know what? He just got dropped. All right, Actualizer. Flying Emperor. What is this? Ooh, a madhouse. Okay. 
super insane luck so far. This this light Milla is more than enough, more than enough to to clear a deliverance. And we got ourselves a Hawkeye or Breath of the Seraphs. The Hawkeye is really nice if for gun zerking. Not so great if you're not gun zerking, but okay. I think we're ready for tier two. Let's roll. Very, very nice. Okay, tier two coming for you. Oh, well, I, I'm not sure if they added any more mini games. Let's see if they changed where the butt stallion is located here. They did not. Okay, sick. Let's roll. Let's roll. Yeah, look out for powerful e tech weapons. Sure, absolutely, I will be. All right, tier two coming at you. I'm very, I'm quite happy with that. Oh, wait. The chest is gone. Hey. Where'd you go? Do you only get it once? That's interesting. All right, show me what I'm working with. Go to the forge. Hopefully, it's the easy forge, not the difficult forge. It's the difficult forge. Okay, we're going to get a turret down just to buy me some time. Light Milla doesn't seem like it's doing the most. Maybe Pimpernel can help me out here. I have maxed out STUs in Sniper, so I am going to lean into my snipers a little bit here. I think that just makes a little, uh, most of them makes the most sense. Okay. There we go. Pimpernel does great work. As always. Good night. What do we get? That's a uh, Mopey's candy. Increased pellet count. That's big. It's going to give me a lot of one shots. Where are you at? Thank you. Lucky there's been no Torg Destroyers. Kill Dozer. Got you. Yeah, well, everything gets one shot. Okay. We can go... I'm going to go right side scotch right here. And I'm going to go pressure. And never punished. We get a, a, another Mopey's candy. Right off rip. Frostburn Canyon. A tough zone. But not with Mo we, um, Mopey's candy. Later, kid. Oh, man. That feels good. The one taps. Later. I think I lost my buff, but that's fine. It's a timed buff. I can't keep it forever. Later. No, later. One thing I want to check for 1.1 update is to see if tier 2 pressure plates... If tier 2 pressure plates do their thing. And by do their thing, I mean, do they have better, better gear? Because before this update, tier 2 pressure plates were the same as tier 1, which is a bunch of... It's a bunch of gemstone items. Which is nice, but tier three is where like it really juices up. So I'm wondering if they change that at all. That's some. I mean, it's a lever that they can change. We know they can change it because it, it is changed in tier three. So our ammo is looking good. The one thing I was concerned about was ammo consumption, but this pimpernel is doing phenomenal work, and yeah, I'm just very much enjoying it. Let's go ahead on this ladder. Oh yeah. Looks like they're still the gemstone items. Very cool. Let's go. Pressure. One point in quick charge, because that makes sense. Kill skill. Killing enemy causes your sh shields to quickly regenerate for a short time. Regenerates 6% of your max shields per second. I think I'm going to take failing shield and then more quick charge. I want to get down to Gemini. I want two turrets. I'm slacking everything anyway. There's really no point in rocking you know, anything else. All right, let's roll. The rust yards. Going to the rust yards. This should be a pretty quick and easy zone. Later, kid. Did you want some? I thought. So if if the items that I'm getting from the pressure plates are just gemstone items, I don't really have to farm them. Oh, what is this? This is a juicehouse candy. Very nice. Get my super speed and melee damage. Later. Nine out of ten. What happens when I have this buff and the super speed? 
I think it might I think I'm going the same same speed as I was earlier. All right, so we do get the vault symbols though. They are still very much powerful. Deputy's badge, that is a nice grab actually. If anyone wondering the if 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 you want to jump on this 1.1 update, the pressure plate for this map is here. Well, hello there, Luke. It's never going to outdamage my Pimpernel, so I'm going to run by it, but if you didn't have a pimper now, you could be searching that stack for droogs for, I mean, any number of weapons. But I think droogs is probably the number one. Okay. Quick charge me. And there comes a point in your life where you're going to have to make a decision. And that decision is going to be not to take resourceful. Maybe it is good. Maybe it's not good. And they, I'm sure the grit and George like, take grit, take grit. Listen, you don't need grit if you're as good as me. Grit only helps when you are about to die. And let's be honest here. I ain't dying. All right, I'm looking for a better shield, so these radios will be getting shot. Don't avoid my damage, bro. You deliberately dodged. Oh my gosh, this Pimpernel absolutely shreds. Couldn't have asked for a better set of loot from that, that dwarf. That dwarf hooked me up like crazy. Pimpernel... I also have healing in my number three spot. You're going down, kiddo. But look at this thing, this absolute wreck face. So when you're using the pimper now, you want to aim a little bit low. That way the, the extra pellets, they rise up and they crit the enemy. I see a Clayton. One more radio right there. Now we got big radio. Okay. You're gone. This guy's got an explosive assault rifle. Don't like that. Oh, I'll see you later, kiddo. Nicely done, brother. Thank you. Thank you. How'd you get so good at the game? How'd you get so good? You know? It's not anyone could become this good. Takes a lot of skill. Let's be honest. Okay, so. I kind of like Maglock. And I kind of like Longbow Turret. And hold on here. Maybe we are going resourceful. A little bit of grit in my life. Okay, let's roll. You just got done talking about how you weren't going to take grit because you never, never fear going down. You don't know anything about Borderlands. Like... That's the problem. That's the difference between you and me. Okay? I know everything about Borderlands, and you know nothing. So don't speak. That's all I'm saying. Okay, I can't hit him yet. The actually invincible. If you're paying attention, you can't hit it yet. And now we can. Pimpernel, do do your dirty work. Okay, it's actually not doing that much damage. Maybe I need to aim for the, the neck here. You gotta go, brother. These are very tanky lads. I need to get one kill. It's my problem. Very kill skill oriented on this character. And for the crit. Ah, okay. Yeah, I'm in trouble, actually. I need to start getting some crits, but I'm not getting any crits. Ah! Help me. Help me. Somebody help me. Give me to this. Give me to this heartbreaker, please. Heartbreaker, job taker. Come on. Get me there. I'm back to full HP, but I'm looking to do is get one kill. Here we go. There's my one kill. And now I can try to DPS the Waddle Gobbler. Not bad. Let's see, let's see what Lyud Miller will do. Okay, that seemed okay. He wasn't charging at me so much, it would be a lot easier to hit him. Come on, Gobbler. What's going on, brother? He doesn't like me. He's like, all those times you killed me? New update, new me. Yeah, new update, new me too as well, friend. Good fight, though. I like that fight a lot. Let's go see what our loot doobie is do. Let's see. Sharon May, not taken. Rough Rider, unfortunately, not taken. Hey, so for as much as great loot as we got the first time around, got pretty dog, 
water loot that time around. The super speed's so nice. Let me tell you, it is so, so nice. It's an absolute game changer. Ooh, I got a longbow or thunderball fist. I'm gonna go thunderball fist. Now, let's go a little bit of grit in my life. Yes. Okay. Now, now we actually have some decisions to make. I think that we want more gun damage from my turrets out. And then I can put, I can get sentry to keep my turret out longer and go resourceful to make sure my turrets are always out. Okay. Marcus's mercenary shop. Oh, board round. Find the token of giving. Oh, we're finding the token of giving. Okay, these snowmen resist. Well, they don't resist this though. Find the token of giving. Find the token of giving. Oh man, this is a fun round. I, this map is incredible. Look at this. Oh, loot frost spider. Loot frost spider. What do you drop? That looks like a, a hammer buster. I like that. I'm pretty sure that's good. I'm pretty sure I like that. Okay, hammer buster me. Let's find this token of giving. That way, we, I know we're not going to get it this time around, but that way for next time, we'll have something. And on my new computer, I've been, I'm looking for the pause recording button. That way, I usually have what I typically do for you guys. is like, I'll, I'll, I'm going to look for it. I'll see you guys in a second. But this time around, um, it's on my OBS. Actually, I don't see a pause. And I tried to set up the, the hockey, but it's just simply not working. So... Let's look around. Let's look around together, shall we? This isn't that big of a zone. What's the token of giving? What's this? Do I have to open up all these? Is that it? Can they even do that? Can they even put stuff inside these? I'm not too sure. Dude, this is a great map. This is a brand new map. I really like these horde rounds. I think they add a great flavor to the game. Wait, what's going? Do these do these just keep respawning? No, okay. Okay, so token of giving. Check underneath stairs. They like to hide stuff underneath stairs. Look up. We look down, and we're jumping around. You know what I'm saying? Where? If I was, if I was Jolt's dude Pyrex. Incorporated, and I were to hide a token of giving, where would I hide it? Hmm. Music goes hard though. I don't mind searching around this map with all this amazing music playing. Token of giving, check the reeds. Check the reeds. Check all of them. Not seeing it. Hmm, token of giving. The other one was small. It was small and it was gold and it was inside a grate. My assumption is that it would be like somewhere stuffed in the middle here. But I have no idea where. Maybe inside this. Um, I was thinking maybe inside this coal. Train cart. I'm it's just I'm just simply not seeing it. Okay. Let's try to cheese the boss then. I, I can I'll come back at a different time and look for it. I'm sure there's not that many different variations of the horde mode. So let's rock. Oh get my Oh bone of the ancients. That's huge. That's ins so it looks like you always get relics from horde mode, and that is insane to, to start getting those. Okay. Let's put one point ranger because it's pretty nice. Um, let's go some points into sentry. Take a juice house candy, chat cheese the next stage. Two, one grab. Oh, we never mind. <laughs> Can't cheese it. All right. Give me something good to eat here. A couple infinity pistols. I mean, my gear is pretty like. 
pretty solid. Legendary Soldier. I personally like the Legendary Ranger, I think, better. Okay, that's going to be... I think that's going to be a better launcher. It's like, now what we're going to do is we're going to take launcher to cap. Grenage to almost to cap. Yep, and we're good. Let's see what raid boss we got. We got Hyperius, which shouldn't be too, too bad. I think corrosive is what we're going to want to use. I don't think I have anything corrosive, though. So let's just see how much damage we can do to this guy. He definitely resists like a ton. Holy cow. That was big resist. How do these guys do against this gun, though? They don't do that great against it. They don't like Lyud Milla. Now, what I don't have is boar. This is what we do. We toss one turret. Toss that one. Destroy it. Now we get our... Do not go down. Now we get our kill skills. There we go. Back to main effort. Oh, gosh. This is going to be a tough fight. Mm, what do we do? One. Two. Pick up. Because I don't want to put any bullets into one of their shields. Who's, who's shields up? There we go. This guy. Okay. Cause my fire leech out. The leeches should be able to heal me up a little bit. Yep. Looks like these guys are heavy resisting. I'm almost out of blammo too, so this is not a good combo. We got probably the two hardest fights I could have asked for. Okay, so out of sniper ammo. What do we have that we can swap to? That'll be good. I think hammer buster. I think you can go wrong with a hammer buster. Let's go ahead and slap it on for Pimpernel. Pimpernel's not that useful here. Okay, that's not the slowest. That's not, it could be faster, but it's not the slowest. Okay. Give my kill skills. That is pretty slow. Shoot. Come on, hammer buster. Get me there. Maybe it's not Hammer Buster. Maybe it's Actualizer. Wow, these guys are tanky. Tanky must prime. Wow, that's a full magazine. No kill. I think this might be scaled up harder. That's three full mags. No kill. The Actualizer is definitely not going to do it. Um, Madhouse, maybe? Okay, that's not bad. We have a little bit of grenade damage scaling, which is nice. Come on. Get us there, Madhouse. This is insanely hard. Ah! So the Madhouse isn't doing the job. Uh, do I just switch to some, the first corrosive gun I see? Yeah. Let's just swap to it. Should be a lot more effective. Okay, relax. Relax, okay, buddy. Let's toss one. Toss two. Get my kill skills. There we go. That's a lot better. I had someone in a YouTube comment say... This guy doesn't even know the the turret axe and kill skill trick, and like I just wanted to like link like to like several videos where I do nothing but axe and kill skill trick to win the win the round, but I didn't. I like this. Okay, let's go ahead and get our kill skills up and running. Oh, I missed I messed it up that time. This guy I don't even know how to do the axe and kill skill trick. I'm a disgusting casual. Thanks to this SMG, we actually have a chance here. Okay. Toss. Pick up. So I have to let it... Looks like I have to let the other one land on the ground. I can't throw it off of the first one. Got it. Okay. It looks like it. when I bounce it off the first turret, it doesn't work. So let's do it. Toss one. Toss two. Don't bounce it. Now pick up. Mm, that one didn't work either. Gotta get a little bit more consistent with it. Okay. We're gonna get one from this guy. Hopefully. Show me the money, buddy. 
There we go. Now we got Metal Storm, Onslaught, Quick Charge. No boar or anything to cheese this fight. And the longer this fight goes, the harder that it becomes. So I'm, I'm not... I'm not... Excited about how this is going to end for me! Get wrecked, kiddo. Out of ammo, though. Okay. So I'll bump a little bit of ammo here. Reload me. Okay. Now you lie, you mill on me. Out of blammo. Not good. Not good. Yep, and his... He's already shredding with his... With his Novas. I didn't get any sniper ammo there. That is a little ridiculous. I have zero sniper ammo and I opened up two ammo things? Holy cow. I'm gonna die. There's, yeah, there's no way I can survive this. Okay. Where are my kill skills? Dang. That's the best, that's the best damage I got right there, I think. Alright, toss one. Toss two. Pick it up. That is just simply not working. I must be doing something wrong. Ah! Fire leech me. I toss one. Toss two in the distance, maybe? No, that didn't work. Just keep shooting. There's only one way to kill the boss, and that is slowly. Come on. Someone, I'm guaranteeing someone is saying, slag him. When you slag this guy, it goes away immediately, friend. When you slag him, it goes away immediately. Those are some good crits right there. We got him a little bit lower. Ow. That hurt. Ow, that hurt. I'm in trouble now. I'm in a lot of trouble. Okay, try my best here. Maybe, actually, this might be where my launcher comes in handy. Come on. Let's get him. Come on, we got this guy. No! Please. No, Hyperius. Wait, hold on here. Hold on a second. This guy's goaded. Reload quickly. Y'all thought it was over. Oh, I'm never over. What, how many times do I have to explain this to you? I am never over. Holy cow. <laughs> Guarantee that you thought it was over too, man. No, I didn't. I, that's the difference between me and you. I knew I was going to be fine there. 100% knew it. Can I get something good here? Let's storm or shot, homing shot crossfire? <laughs> I'm just not a let storm guy. I'm just not a let storm guy. It's just not. It's just not me. Very sick. Okay. Tier two down. On to tier three. Ooh, this is a new one. This is new right here. Let's see. Find the lever. Oh, I can find the lever. Trust me. Oh, trust me. I can find the lever. Let's go. If I'm a lever, where would I be? Well, do I just... I think I just keep going. Right? Dude, it's so easy. A door has been opened. Understood. Was it this door that was opened? Play... Don't... Do not... Speak to me. About puzzles, okay? That's the easiest puzzle of my life. Of my entire life, I'm telling you. Alright, chest me? How dare you? Alright, gub. Still gubs. And honestly, I am going to take a gub. I wish I had a gub for that last fight. To be honest. But we can go back to my boy the pimp. Ernell. <laughs> um, yeah, let's go pimp Ernell. I haven't gotten, like, anything... Like, explosive crazy. The Kerblaster is nice. The fire is so slow. The fire is so slow. Okay, let's roll. 
Wait, maybe if I melee this guy all three rounds. I wonder if you melee him all three rounds and something happens. Oh, what's this? This is new. Are these always class mods in here? No, it looks like a sniper. Very interesting things are happening nowadays in the rogue lands. I'll tell you what. Very interesting things. Let's get out of here. The boneyard. Let's rock it. All right, we're officially on tier three. Enemies are tanky, and they want to kill us. I could have slapped on my corrosive damage relic now that I'm thinking about it. That last fight, that was not bad. I could have been doing a lot more damage. Okay. Goodbye. Goodbye. Farewell. Pimpernel. All right, so for, the, for tier three, we definitely want to be hitting up all the pressure pads. I want to get myself a... Whatever that, whatever that sorry for is, that is, yes, that one, the peak opener. That's what I'm looking for. <laughs> yes. <laughs> All right, let's slap it on to legendary soldier class mod, peak opener. Mouthwash is probably goaded here. My biggest issue is that I'm I'm not going to have no shock damage anywhere. Go mouthwash. My biggest issue is I'm not going to have a lot of assault rifle blammo, but honestly, peak opener will get me there. So, Pimpernel, Heartbreaker for healing. And we have peak opener for, for general mobbing. Legendary soldier class mod. Oh, let's go. And you know what? Let's, let's, let's open up some relics. Let's see what we get. Might and Breath of the Seraphs. Okay. We're chill. Five points. Oh, a little grog nozzle for your life. Yeah, 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 Since we have Legendary Soldier, I want to put one point across the board here. I like that. And let's rock, let's rock today some Battlefront. Some Sentry. So now whenever I have a turret out, I just do a, I do a lot more damage. Let's keep one turret out for now. No reason to be doing the kills, kill shenanigans. And I believe when you place the second one, it drains faster. Could be wrong about that. I think that's how that works. I think it is better to have just use one, but just keep two out here. Might as well. The bubbles were helping me stay alive. Later, kid. Don't even speak. That's the, that, that's the, that's your problem. You're trying to speak to me. Don't speak. Like the robots aren't talking at all, bro. If you're the only one talking. You're yapping. You're, you're yapping so hard. Yes, so. Dude, put me on the peak opener with high graphic quality. Okay, <laughs> never mind. Give me peak, peak opener. I'm sorry, uh, Pimpernel. Pimpernel peak opener, dude. This is this is the way. This is absolutely the way. Blasted. But since I got a new computer, a lot of my old photos and stuff are gone. So like, I'm gonna have to go out into the world and farm for new backgrounds and stuff like that. I have a couple good spots that, that seem to work pretty well in the YouTube thumbnails. One of them is in Sanctuary, so I can actually just go to Sanctuary and get it there. Let's toss a, let's toss a turret down and actually second turret me. Help me out here. Bubble me. Ow, ow, ow. Ow, ow, ow. <laughs> yes. All right. Definitely going to want to grab this pressure plate. What you got for me? Mouthwash with higher damage value. Good. Rest of my gear is is well butcher. That's kind of nice. A longbow fire bee. I'm look. I'm, I want a bee. That's not a longbow fire bee. I want a bee shield. If you don't mind. My main goal is to get a bee shield and then act like I don't know nobody. Thank you, turret, for everything you've done for me. Okay. I don't necessarily think I need a 
I need any points into overload for my assault rifle. I think I'm I'm being chilling without it, to be honest. More turret duration. And let's just go for more defense. Okay, southern shelf. This is another easy round, and we know where everything is, which is a big plus. Let's take the higher damage mouthwash, and we just use this peak opener until we run out of ammo with it, and then we swap over. Of course, I could juice up my damage more by tossing a turret down. No, that's just axe and things. We're actually tossing a turret up. Works as well. I've come to realize the axe and I mean, his his axe his his capstones are good, but really it's it's the explosive damage combined with some of the higher powered explosive damage weapons that really to make Axe a strong character. I think he's one of the best. I I don't know. I know that you know people have always said that he's a little bit weaker. I think with the addition of the peak opener into the game, like you you really can't say he's a weak character. He's actually quite quite strong. The unforgiven. God finger, a second God finger. Unicorn explosion could be a good backup. Oh, check my inventory first for rewards. Honestly, it's not Orphan Maker at Sandhawk. Don't and 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 do not at me about that. Okay, got this vault symbol. Let's roll. Should be a mini boss round now. We should be that's, um, not quite our final chance to get the B shield, but. It, one of our last chances to get the beast shield was right there. I'm not going to be farming the banjos. Simply because I don't really care for anything E-Tech at this point. Even if it is a top near or something. Okay. I think we'll have a decent dragon fight. We have a Lyud Milla to do some big deeps. I just really wish we had a beast shield. Axon's really good about... Keeping the beast shield up and running. Spike go, my homie. So it doesn't look like they've made any adjustments to this map, which was the one map I wish they would have, but the spike goes a little bit buggy. Sometimes he's outside the map. Trust me, you, you don't want this fight, brother. Good night. Got me anything? No. Okay. Legendary Ranger, legendary engineer. Okay. Do we have any more points? No, we're all out of points. That's fine. Ooh, Dragon Keep. Tough fight. We start off with the f someone that we can kill somewhat easily, I think. We also turret down to get some more deeps. Don't get hit by that ice goal, uh, ice, ice attack. Okay, so this next guy, he resists shock. So instead, I'm going to go for slag. To land some crits on him. There we go. That's a good crit right there. That's what we're looking for. Get a, let's get one kill on a skeleton, hopefully. Wow, these guys are tanky, huh? Here we go. Give me some crits. There we go. Oh, loot, loot animated skeleton. Man, kill that guy. Kill that guy. Get that guy. Get that guy. Come on. Where is he at? Did he die yet? No, he's still alive. He's over here. Get him. Oh, it's a striker. Ah, uh, I was playing gauge or something. I'd be super happy about that. Let's pop this. Shrine. And start going for my boy. My boy, Red. This is a nice warm-up fight, because this is similar, similar to the dragon fight, to be honest with you. Multiple phases, different elemental immunities. Okay. Down goes Frazier. Right? Down goes Frazier. There we go. Now we get, get some time on the boss with, with my kill skills up. Yes. Tier 3. Tier 3 stands no chance against my Axton. Like, literally zero. Stop hitting my turret, bro. Dude, so not cool. Yeah. Get wrecked. Now you, now you just set up your guy for failure. Go all because you wanted to hit my turret. You did that, not me. He goes, you were going to kill me anyway. Yes, so. 
Okay, so it doesn't look like we do get the B-Shield this game. I don't need a B-Shield to win, but it just makes it a lot easier. Okay. Oh, breathe, Michael, breathe. We still have a Horde round to get through. Okay. Collect my reward. How about a B-Shield? No. All right, come on now. Wham, bam, island for Horde rounds. Token of Vitality? I could do that. I could find one of those. I know exactly where it is. Check out this one. It's gonna... Hey, wait, I'm stuck. Soft locked. It's hurt me. Holy cow. Oh my goodness gracious. All right, so let's practice this little swap. We can toss this out and just swap as the grenades are blowing up. That'll be helpful for healing purposes. And we have a perfect gun for this. Absolutely perfect. Player kid. All right, token of vitality. I'm gonna do a quick search. Is it inside the egg? Ooh, transformer shield actually makes a lot of sense. Found you. Found the token of vitality. Nice. Okay. I don't know what it does. I think I might have to place iridium. 100 iridium. I placed 100 iridium. Oh, what is this? Shop. It's not working though. It's like, oh, nice. Oh, it's a it's a mix. This is incredible. It's a Miss Moxie's vendor. If you are if you're in need of Moxie weapons, this is the place to be right here. That's that's a really really nicely done. Okay, let's roll. Pick my reward first. Of course, you're gonna get me what I want, right? Nope. Never lucky, bro. Let's roll. Sanctuary then dragons we can do it right surely Okay Nice Here we go, this is it the winged storm now I Honestly think that we might have a little bit more success with the legendary point man Doesn't give us any points in willing though I think a respec is most certainly, most certainly required here. I'm going to go impact. I think I want to have slag turrets. I don't want to be killing my turrets for kill skills until much later. Go reload speed. Willing is the most important skill here, probably. I want a little bit more healing. Able. Some more turret duration. And we're going to go double up with slag turrets. I think that's going to be important. Next thing is going to be Metal Storm. I know it's a kill skill, but we can proc it. Steady. All right, let's go preparation. One point healthy. Pressure. Forbearance makes a lot of sense to me. I don't think Failing Shield matters. I don't think Maglock matters, so I don't need those. We can go Resourceful. Grit. X2. Yeah. Okay. Seven more points. Do or die makes a ton of sense to me. Let's go last ditch effort. A little bit of quick charge. A little bit of last ditch effort. And one point in the battlefront, I think, is good. All right, dragons. Let's bring uh, green down here if we can. Don't throw my turret down because it'll shoot a dragon that I don't want to shoot. Okay, green should be coming down here now. I can throw down my turret. Worth my life. And try my absolute best to kill this brutally invincible character. So I'm not sure what's going on and why I have multiple pelts. Or do I have multiple pelts? I'm not too sure. But it's the Grognaz effect. That's what it was. So green is going to die here. Big damage going down on green. Okay. Now, I have the transformer. So honestly, 
I kind of want to get Brood down here, but I don't have a good way to bring him down. I'm sorry, not Brood. Boost. There we go. I hit him. I hit you, bro. Come on down. Oh, healing at the invincible came down. Okay, we can just Pimpernel this guy. Oh, we need to, need to heal up. Heal. Heal me. Thank you. Not sure how this guy came down in here, but I really didn't want to get healing in. Because I have a transformer shield, which gives me a ton of value against him. So I'd rather, yeah, somebody else. Anybody else. You. Surely that has to trigger you to jump down here, right? This guy does not want to drop. Come on now. Is that not enough? Is that not enough to get this guy to drop down? I just don't understand it. I can't see anything. Good. Here we go. He's down. Okay, he goes down. And now, let's go for the fire guy. We go for the fire lad. Next. Yeah, he, he's down on the ground now. Toss a turret. Get my grog out. Get my grog out. There we go. The Grog shouldn't have nearly enough damage to kill these lads. But what it should do is give me a little bit of health back. Okay. Slag up this lad. He slagged. Come on. Peek opener. You are the weapon of destiny. Together, we will defeat them. Nicely done, peak opener. Okay. So now... Peak opener can go away, and what do we really, what do we need to end this run? Kerblaster? I think Kerblaster could work. We just need to get this guy down now. There we go. Kerblaster can work. Let's go ahead and toss, let's go ahead and get a kill on this guy. I don't think this dragon has any chance to kill me now. Not with my Transformer. The Transformer blocks all shock damage, so. Toss one turret. Toss second turret. Pick up first turret. Give, give me my action skills. Actually, I could probably just go Pimpernel here, right? A little, bit, a little bit more efficient. One turret. Second turret. Pick up. I need something non-elemental to bring this guy down. Non-elemental. Hawkeye. Perfect. And let's go... Sniper rifle damage wherever you are. Thank you. Hawkeye. Okay, we are tagging him. Is that a power-up right there? No, it's a heal juice. Okay. There we go. This is exactly what we're looking for right here. There's a reason we saved this guy for last, because the, the peak opener does really good damage, and it helps us kill all the other dragons. Plus, a transformer shield helps us just absolutely... This guy can't really damage us, so... No matter what he does. And ladies and gentlemen, this is a Roguelands mini win. You were here. First run. The first run on 1.1.0. We make it happen. Fireworks me. Yes. Incredible. Absolutely incredible. That is what I'm talking about. Amazing. Every change that I've seen so far. Every change. Incredible stuff. Wow. It doesn't get much better than that. And if we had a bee shield or something. Wow, look at the wind. Look at the way we're, we're being knocked back. Wow. I would drop in there, but once once you drop in here, there's no way out. Yeah, once you slide down there, there's no way out. I don't want to go in there. But you can see it if you... You can see something down there if you look in between the cracks here. Wow.
a really, really fun gameplay experience. Congratulations on beating Rogue Lands. Your run ends here, and you will not be set back to the main menu. Thanks for checking out the mod. Thank you. 1.0.1 update, or 1.1.0 update. Incredible changes to the game. Thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed, hit the like button. Subscribe to see more videos like this one. And I'll see y'all in the next one. Bye. Thank <laughs> you.